Welcome back to Learning Tour Tracks. Today, we're going to be learning Sydney Sprint. And right now, we're going to be checking out the world record and trying to take from some strategies that this player is doing. I'm going to try to do this for every single Learning Tour Tracks video or any of the Learning Track videos because I feel like it's important to learn the strategies and there's no one better to watch than the current world record holder. So we're gonna learn specifically where to mushroom, I think is the most important thing for me to learn, uh, at least on the first go around. And then I'll try to just basically beat my time by not running into walls. That's basically my main problem with the tour tracks. So we'll see. Damn, you did that with one mushroom? Oh boy. That's gonna be a struggle bus for me. So that was one mushroom. Okay, we'll see how many times I fail that shortcut. Probably a bunch. And they only tricked three times on all of those ramps. Second mushroom here? Yes. Okay. Okay, I probably will never be able to do that. But we're gonna try, I guess. Watching world record holders is just incredible. Like, I will never be this good. That's crazy. And it seems so easy when you watch it. It's like, oh, yeah, I can do that. No, no, you can't. I can't. There's no way I can. And that final mushroom spot is right here. Oh boy, a minute and 59 seconds. Okay, let's see what I can do. <laughs> he did use Teddy Buggy though, right? Pretty sure he did. But I'm gonna try with Bitty Buggy just because why not? I could try um, Teddy Buggy if I want to. If this combo doesn't do very well, we'll see. My goal, I guess, is to get maybe... Two minutes and 15 seconds for my first run? We'll see. Probably not gonna happen if I start bonking the walls. I missed that coin, the first one, unfortunately. But I got the other two, so that's always good. Okay, so the first mushroom is right here. Um. Okay! I almost got it. Sure, I bonked the pole there, but... I think I almost got it, right? Hopefully they didn't go even further than that. They might have. Hmm. Maybe I didn't do it. We'll see. Okay, I tricked like four times. I think they tricked three times. Still, not doing too bad. This was the other mushroom. And then the last mushroom is at the very, very end. And they skipped all of that. I gotta remember to do that. Or at least attempt to. We'll see. Okay. Still don't have 10 coins. Unfortunately. But now I do. There we go. Alright, what did I say? 215 was my goal? It might happen. Okay, look at that. 214, even better. Alright, let's just try to do... Okay, I think the, the first section at least is pretty straightforward. So let me backtrack on what I was going to say. And let's do the first section and the second section. As long as I don't bonk the wall on this first shortcut in the first section. But I want to see if I can do the shortcut on the second section after that staircase. Basically jumping over the railing, which is insane to me. But we'll give it a go. We'll see how it goes. No promises. But hey, if I can pull that off online, that would be amazing for me. I definitely need to learn a lot of shortcuts. 
Um, unfortunately, I haven't learned a lot of the new track shortcuts, and even the old track shortcuts. I mean, I'm definitely lacking on my knowledge of shortcuts. Oh, there we go. That wasn't so bad. Pretty happy with that. I mean, if I end up doing okay, maybe we'll just continue and see what this run has in store for us. We'll see. I'm already up to 10 coins, which is better than the last time. All right, second mushroom here. Not bad. I think they do the motion glider. Oh no, I missed that. That's unfortunate. Hmm. I kind of want to keep going because I'm curious. And we'll keep going. Sorry, I do like to work the sections, but so far on this track, I'm not doing terrible in my opinion. I do play this track a decent amount in Worldwide, so I'm not completely unfamiliar with the track. But at least I'm decent at uh, that first shortcut at the beginning of the second section, so I feel decently comfortable with that. Oh, this is... I just shaved off a couple seconds here. Look at that. Shaved off nearly four seconds. All right, we will work the first section once again, and then I will just cut to the second section. That way you guys are just seeing me kind of work the shortcuts on the second section. You're not seeing me replay the first section over and over and over again. I'm not trying to bore you guys to death. If you guys are still watching, thank you very much. And if you're still watching, consider subscribing. If you're already in, like, what, five minutes into the video, I appreciate you guys. If you guys are a returning subscriber, thank you for watching my content. I severely appreciate it. Definitely love playing Mario Kart. So, if you guys are interested and want to play some races with me, head over to Twitch. I do stream on there periodically. Not a ton. Um, because I am focusing on YouTube content right now. So... Getting home from work, I usually just kind of record. Alright, that's not too bad. I did hit the grass a little bit, so... Not bad, though. But yeah, as I was saying, I just kind of focus on making some YouTube content. Um, I did stream a lot, but now with my new job, I've definitely just been trying to prioritize YouTube because... With my last job, I definitely stopped uploading and stopped streaming altogether. That was terrible. That was terrible. That was terrible. <laughs> That's okay. We'll try to get the shortcut up here. And then I'll focus on... Okay. We're learning. But like I was saying, with the last job I had, I kind of neglected YouTube and Twitch. So I wasn't making content at all. Just because that job really didn't have any work-life balance. I was working all the time. Even at home, my phone was blowing up. Ooh, that was terrible. That's okay, we'll just focus on the second shortcut. Um, but this new job definitely has some work-life balance, and it's great. So I'm just going to focus on YouTube and stream kind of whenever I can. I'm going to aim for three times a week. It's probably going to be two times a week, but if you guys join the Discord in the description down below, you can just click the link and you will see whenever I kind of decide to go live. I don't really have a set schedule, unfortunately. I need to work on it, but for now, it's just kind of sporadic. Alright, let's try to... I'm so close! I don't need a mushroom, though. Maybe I have to get, like, a super mini turbo? Dang, why can I not do that? Oh, there we go! Okay, so it's all about line on that one. Let's keep going. I'll work the third section. I'm pretty sure the third section is, is fairly straightforward. Uh, so if this goes well, I'll try to do some full runs. But I'm very happy that I pulled off that shortcut. Even if I don't become like an expert on that shortcut, that's perfectly fine. At least I know I can do it. I was able to do it once, meaning I could totally do it again. Oh, jeez. Alright, I think I beat the record by 
a hair. Yes, I did. All right, here we go. Full run number one. We're going to do three as long as nothing catastrophic happens. I'm not going to count that, uh, that little wall bump. It'll be okay. So the goal to beat is two minutes and ten seconds. If I can drop it down... Hmm, I guess 209. I don't really see myself going any faster than that. I think on the second run, we're going to try Teddy Buggy. And see if that makes it a little faster. I'm not really sure. Let me know if you guys would like to see the ghost... Um, on these videos? I usually don't care to have the ghost on there. I feel like it just kind of gives me anxiety to be like, oh my goodness, the ghost is ahead of me, or, you know, they're closing in on me or something, so I just don't put it on. I just focus on the actual track and not what my ghost is doing. But then again, the ghost is good. I mean, you can learn from it and see what they're doing versus uh, what your current character is doing. So, either way, I don't know. Let me know what you guys want. Oh, ooh, oh, goodness. Okay, I recovered, so that's important. We did it. <laughs> oh, that was slow because I didn't get my drift. That was slow, too. Oh well. All right. Can we do it? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> A little slow. Yep, that was slow. 211. All right, switching over to Teddy Buggy. Let's see how this goes. If I somehow shave off some seconds, I'll be really impressed. I doubt it, though. But, I mean, then again, this cart has a uh, better speed than a Biddy Buggy, so it might actually work out in my favorite. We'll see. I don't usually take this path. I don't know why I took it. Probably for the coin, I guess. That's my excuse. Get these coins. I will be honest, my lines with Teddy Buggy, I think, are better. Just because I play this combo a lot more than Biddy Buggy. Biddy Buggy used to be my main combo. But then, Yoshi Teddy Buggy came out. Mm, about the same on that shortcut. It's my line for sure. Hopefully, I'm able to actually do this shortcut. We will see. This is a terrible time for my nose to kind of be itchy. Ooh, that line was better. It felt better for me, at least. Oh, no! Dang it. We'll just keep going. It's okay. Definitely not the end of the world there. Just curious to see what I end up with. It should be about four seconds slower. Oh, geez. Way slower, actually. I keep bonking things. Oh, no. Ugh. 2.15. All right. The last full run of the video. Let's hopefully get that shortcut. That's the goal. If not, hey, the main goal of this video is not to become a professional. I'm just trying to get used to the tracks, comfortable with the tracks, enough to be able to vote for them when they pop up on Worldwides. Alright, this time we're gonna go left path. I don't know why I went right path, that was silly. 
pretty sure you get the same amount of coins too. Not bad. I think I usually get there around 40 seconds, so 39. It's not too bad. Definitely a little bit of an improvement. Okay. That was slightly better than the other attempts. Okay. Not too bad. Oh, that was a terrible line though, unfortunately. I kind of hopped on the, the little mound there. Oh, let's go. That was perfect. At least in my opinion, it was perfect. To a world record holder, that was not perfect. But you know what? I am not a world record holder, and I probably never will be. And that's okay. Oh, jeez. All right. Not bad. Oh yeah, as long as I don't mess anything up. Two oh nine. I was so close to two oh eight. But I'll take it. That is going to do it for the video. If you guys did enjoy, go ahead and drop a like down below. Maybe even subscribe. Hopefully you guys have an awesome day. And I will definitely see you guys later. Goodbye.